Dude, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Hello my geeky guys and gals, welcome back to Call of Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth. I'm your host, Mars Geek. And let's get right back into this. I must admit, it has been a good few weeks since I last played this. Because I suffered a problem. As you always do, well at least as I always do, at least any room. Because I intended to play this a few weeks back. Because, if you remember, there's supposed to be a policeman that uh, patrols up and down there. Is my internet back? So I've been having internet problems as well. But yeah, it's supposed to be a, a police officer that goes up and down there. And I got my um, position wrong in the last part as well. I'm not an inspector, I'm just a private investigator. So yeah. I got slapped down with the law, man. But anyway, yeah, since I, I wanted to play this again a couple of weeks ago, but for whatever reason, I just lost all my save game files. Like, oh shit. Um, which one's used again? Hold on, I just gotta check. Action is F. It won't budge. It won't budge. Of course it won't. Can I just get straight out here? Yeah, I lost all my save games, so it was like, I can't play it again. Okay, hi. Oh, is this the beast? Is this him? You'd better keep your trap shut. What? I won't tell him anything. Tell me what? Tell I'm me what? for Brian Burnham. Sorry, stranger. I can't help you. Of course not. Do you know the Burnham lad? He worked in the First National. Please stop bothering me, stranger. Nah, I, I want to know this. This town's um... deserted. Where is everybody? Just leave me be, stranger. Oh, Where is come everybody? On. It's very quiet. I can't be seen talking to you. Well, he's obviously a uh, wealth of information, ain't he? Hey, yeah, lost most of the normal people in this town are too frightened to tell me much of anything. No shit. There's a dark lord beast of the fucking underworld coming around somewhere. It won't budge. I mean, it's going to be a long time since so we're probably going to see him, if he ever actually shows up in this game. But, yeah, I lost all my save games, so I couldn't play the game from where I left off before. So what I did was I played the game again open. offline, got up to the same point again. I did everything exactly the budge. same as to what I did in the playthrough before, right up to the same point, and then once I got it there, then I'm back into it. So, yeah, I lost a bit of time playing it, but we're back. Also, as well, hi. Do you know the Burnham lad? He worked. Can't say I noticed what you're saying, stranger. Shh, what? I'm looking for Brian Burnham. I never heard of no Burnham. Man, you need some strips down your throat, you know, because it sounds a bit rough. So at least we're back now. We're back in. Oh, hi. How about that? Oh, hi. Choices. Um. Did I just see your evil twin brother? I'm looking for Brian Burnham. You're in the wrong place, asking the wrong questions, outsider. I you know the Burnham lad. He worked in the First National. Can't say as I noticed what you're saying, stranger. Yeah, definitely this is even between deserted. Brother. Where is everybody? I reckon you might have scared him off with that ugly face of yours. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. I mean, it's not as bad as yours. You probably scared them off. I mean, you got a big fat face, you got a big fat tummy. I mean, you don't, you're not exactly packing a six pack there. More of a whole beer factory. It's even worse than a beer keg. Where is everybody? It's very quiet. If you don't like it, just turn around and leave. <laughs> Hi. How are you? Hey, sir. 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 Uh, fucking walk away you from me. You know lad. He worked. I can't be seen talking to you. Fine, I'll do it all myself. Squeeze me? Is that Cthulhu? Oh, um, ooh, spoopers. The store is closed. Anyway, another thing I've done as well is I've downloaded the full HP Lovecraft. Oh, nice! I've got to go down there. Yeah, I've downloaded the whole HP Lovecraft that works onto my Kindle app on my iPad. So now, 
I'm slowly reading through that whenever I've got time, so I can make comparisons to that to his storyline as well as the, um, as well as this game. I mean, I'm not far into it already, but Good evening. hi, Good evening, man. Uh, the name's Jack Walters. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss. Miss will do for now. Welcome to Innsmouth, Mr. Walters. Thanks, I think. Take my advice. Do what you must and then leave. Tonight, this port does not cater well to visitors. While I appreciate your concern, miss, I can handle lousy hospitality. Very yeah. well, Mr. Walters. Okay. Everyone's fine and fancy super doll in here. seems more open than some folks around these parts. But she isn't going to talk to me right in that storage depot. It's shut. Okay. How about you, sir? Were you the one from... Hello, Mackie. Yeah, you Jack. are. Jack, swell to see you again. You're the guy Any from earlier. on the Burnham case? Nope. Did you know the lad at all? Just pleasantries. Seemed a nice enough fella. If a little rough around the edges. Strange business, though. I'd never have fingered him as a crook. The First National was a well-run store. A rare thing here in Innsmouth. Okay, Mackie. Thanks. Goodbye, Jack. Be careful what you're doing. Very careful. Innsmouth's a dangerous place. Not everyone who visits here ends up leaving by the old bus route. Kill. This Mackie character knows plenty. But I don't think grilling him for scraps of information is going to crack this case. Right. Sorry about if my webcam stutters every now and again right now. <coughs> Squeeze on me. But I've just reset the router while I'm in the middle of playing this game. And I'm loading up Chrome on the Mac right now. And it does seem that the internet's back for the time being. So, I mean, I'm, it's using most of the CPU core just to record this video. That's how old the Mac is. But it was just weird. When I finished recording the last video... Oh, is there anything down there? Yep, yeah, there's something down there, alright. I want to go see. But yeah, um, reset the route while in the middle of the game. It won't budge. And it seems to be back alright for now, so hopefully that was good. I've had a few connection problems ever since playing the last the game. That pumps highly compressed air. Maybe I'm having the spoopers happen in my house. Maybe I'm not supposed to play horror games because I'm so, so dumb thickness of playing them. Maybe. I just take so fucking long playing them. Any squeezel? Yeah. I'll be with you in a minute, sir. It's just an advertisement for the local Methodist church. Uh huh. It won't budge. You're going to think, say. Well, you can certainly got something to splur. Oh, dude, man, really in the street. I mean, I know it's 1920s, but I'm pretty sure that high end places at least would have had um, internal plumbing. And the growling thunder sounds is oh, wait, 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 oh, wait, shit, where's my phone? Ah, oh, fuck it. I was gonna put my flashlight on and sing along with him like that. No, no, And I got something like that already. Yeah. Okay, what I'm doing is I'm gonna keep the game uncut from now on because reading the um, HP Lovecraft story. I want to make comparisons because I want to see if they've got the same names in here, young fella. like they do in the game, Here'll in the book. something in gratitude that may help you in your search. Dude, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Oh, you got me a key for something. But you mentioned the store, so that's probably where I need to go. <sighs> He's up now. Now you be calling me crazy. Like them that star rumor in an anchor in an lip switch. <laughs> but old Zadok's seen all manner of wicked things since before oh, he was born. Fucking voice mm. acting's great. Uh, old Captain Moby to where it all began. 
telling desperate folks they'd order get better gods. Them's that would answer their prayers. Didn't the Christian folk of Innsmouth object to such blasphemy? Aye, they did. It were around 46 that many folks in town were done with Obed and his ways. And all that wild preaching and too many missing, you see. Um, a party of good folk followed Captain Obed's crowd out to the reef. Shots were fired. Next day, Obed and thirty of his fathers were in jail. And Isn't for that a prologue? weeks all were quiet. Till that artful night of forty-six, them's out outside reckon out it being a riot. But I'd seen them. Swarms of He's like Gollum. I precious. Look, old man. I don't have time to listen to these fishing tales. Oh, was a massacre. The jail thrown open. Mounds of the dead and the dying. Shooting and screaming and shouting all across the town square. Come morning, the mess was cleaned up. Old Obed and his family takes charge, they did. Folks were told to keep shy as strangers if we were known what was good for us. Sadok, who did all this? Who did all? Said the old captain was now deeper in debt to his even gods. They were hankering for more than just sacrifices. Obed told folks. They had to take the oaths of Dagon. What the hell are these oaths? Yeah, now it's just oh, that's okay. old waste about oaths of Dagon. I, he take the third oath. Just head over to his hole in the dark street. Then you'll see. For definite. He's given me a key to the town poorhouse. It could come in handy. Oh, I wanted the store. He made something a mention about it, mind you. We don't know because he just handed his hand out and we just got the clinky noise of a key. It won't budge. Okay. Okay, what about it him? Won't open. Nope. Ta ha tonight. Boys we must fight, but the winds we shower our yell shall never scare us. Cool, them whatever man, I'm gone. Yeah, I'm going to keep this actually completely and utterly unedited now, so for those that... Hi, Missy. Are you going to say something to me now? Mr. Walters, I must speak with you. Uh-huh. It's Jack. And just hold on there a minute, sweetheart. Are you going to even tell me your name? My name's Rebecca Lawrence, and unless you want to join Innsmouth's long list of missing, I'd urge you to follow me. Hi, cool. Missing, huh? Like Burnham? I bet. I'm not sure. You'd be better off asking the Billingham's daughter, Ruth. She was dating Brian. What? Who's Ruth? Quickly, you have to follow me. It's not wise to be seen talking to outsiders. Alright, lead the way. That Jack, quick. I know where I am. a strange place. There are things that have no business being here. Foul, reeking things. Strange. Trust me. I'm good with strange. Mm -hmm. That remains to be seen, but I can help you. My father discovered this strange sign while studying an old manuscript. It seems to ward off the more unusual elements and. In that a safe station? Just saying. Whenever you find one, you can use it to find a moment. Oh, it is there. Yeah. Now I must leave before I we're seen. I knew that though. Then. I gotta go save on that. I've seen that eye-like symbol somewhere before, but never surrounded by a star. Actually, that's a good point. Damn, she moved quick. She's like a fart in the wind. So, save it from here. No, no, no. Save it an empty slot. That'll do. Uh, so, yeah, that's the new one. Look at the amount of time that's passed since the last one and now. Anywho, all my geeky guys and gals. I'm going to end the video here, but what I've been trying to say is that I'm going to keep this playthrough now completely and utterly unedited. That's because if you read the works of H.P. Lovecraft, from what I've already seen in the first chapter that I've read, 
the amount of description that he puts into it is phenomenal. It is absolutely brilliant. It really goes into detail about things. And I'm up to a, a section now where um, it seems like things are kicking off with the police and the occult. I'm not going to say too much for in case anyone actually wants to read H.P. Lovecraft because there is a story in there called Call of Cthulhu. So that is what I'm reading through right now. So I'm reading that, getting to know, get, uh, getting to know the synopsis of Cthulhu and how H.P. Lovecraft r words his stories and see how this game compares to it. And doing it uncut also allows those that have well, those that are watching the video but also know and have read H.P. Lovecraft's work to see how well this game goes by it. So maybe you've already picked up a few similarities, maybe you haven't, I don't know. If you have, it'd, it'd be great. Just only comment though below as to what you've seen that does compare to the actual story from what you picked up. In another time though, well, in another words, if you haven't read H.P. Lovecraft's work, I'd really recommend that you do it. I mean, the whole works that I managed to get downloaded off of Amazon, it only cost me one pound. One British pound. That is all. So you could, if you're in the US, I think it's about, it might actually be even 99 cents. I'm not sure, because obviously I don't check the American site. But exchange rate wise, obviously you're looking roughly about one, one dollar thirty, maybe one dollar forty, maybe, depending on tax and things like that. So it is cheap, and that is the whole works. You get the whole works of H.P. Lovecraft, not just Call of Cthulhu. You get everything, so you can indulge your mind. Anyway, I'm going to end it here, my geeky guys and gals. And after this, I'm also going to look up of how long this game is going to be, because it might be where I might have to put the videos longer as well to keep up to date with the story, and so I can get through things a lot quicker, but we'll see. Thank you so much for watching my video, my geek guys and girls. If you liked it, smack the like button. If you didn't, smack the dislike button. If you do the dislike though, please leave me a comment down below and let me know what I can do to improve the video just for you. And as always, if you want to know when the next video is coming out, smack the subscribe button over there. And I'll see you in the next video. So bye, -bye. For now. Ah! Fuck. No. What the fuck? Dude! Quantum stimulation chip. Don't know what you are, so... Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Ow! That hoodie. Oh, no! Do you think I made a good Cthulhu? Nah, because I'm wearing headphones. Fuck it, I spoiled the illusion.